Hey Vikes, I'm Allie and you're watching SBTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Beginning Monday, November 23rd, most Washburn Tech classes will be moving to an online remote format until the end of the semester. You will receive information about your program soon. This change at Washburn Tech does not alter your schedule at SHS. Congratulations to the Seaman musicians that auditioned and made the Northeast Kansas All District assembles. Please wear pink on Monday and Tuesday for Stevie Turner. Finals this year have been pushed back to January. Let's see how the students are reacting to it. This year, because of COVID-19, finals have been pushed back to January. We asked students how they feel about that. I think the final schedule is interesting because <laughs> um, we've never had finals after winter break. It's normally like you do your finals and then you go to winter break. So um, it'll definitely be different than it has been in the past. I kind of liked having my finals before winter break because a really long break, you can lose a lot of information that you've been working all semester on. Typically, we've taken them before winter break. I think it's going to be more difficult to retain the information that we learned over the semester if we take them after winter break, but I also understand how we lost a lot of time this semester due to COVID and hybrid learning, and I think I understand why it's necessary that we have finals after winter break. Usually before, I would say before, I'd rather have finals at the end of the semester while we're having school at the very end I feel like I'm going to lose a lot of information over winter break. But also, I guess it's a way, or it gives us extra time to study for finals, so that might be a benefit to having it after winter break. Even though finals are after winter break, make sure you take that time to study. Today at 115, Cameron Turner will sign a letter of intent to play volleyball at KU. Congrats, Cam. There will be an informational meeting with the coaches on Friday at 115 at the West Commons for a group of B students interested in trying out for the SHS bowling team. Now on to Zoe with the weather. Good afternoon, Vikings. We have been experiencing quite warm temperatures, but we are expecting the 40s and 50s to return starting next week. Today is National Pop Day and National Play Monopoly Day, so make sure to drink some pop while playing Monopoly. Today we are going to be fairly warm where our temperatures are, but the 20 mile to 30 mile per hour wind speeds we are expecting is going to make it feel a lot cooler than 70 degrees. For SVTV 7 day forecast, this weekend and next week we are expecting rain to move through the area. This rain is also going to bring a cold front with it, dropping our temperatures clear down to the 40s and 50s. Now back to your anchors. Thanks, Zoe. That's all for today, Vikes. Have a great day. I hate this change.